All right, welcome, welcome. So, like I said, uh, it's going to be one of those days where they are using a lot of people in a wheelchair. And I've talked about this before. You know, after they done uh, put me through a blitz for a week or two, um, when whatever they're trying to do doesn't work, they will resort back to the many different ways of targeting. Right, so I talk about they will. There are days after the blitz will they will use uh, people in a wheelchair, like on the bus. Um, there were at least uh, two people on the same bus that I was on came in in wheelchairs. Uh, on the street, there were uh, besides the one that I showed you guys in the previous videos that I, I upload. Uh, there were at least two more uh, while I was on the bus outside on my way to my destination so again like i said this is all uh, a pattern some of the patterns will repeat more frequently others they will wait and you and use specifically when they are trying to do certain things right and again it always comes down to uh sending you subliminal message about taking away your disability right or if you are working to get you fired from your job, particularly if you're exposing what it is that they are doing to you, right? So if you're a TI and you're working and, uh, you know, the people at your job are, are your manager or your supervisor, uh, when they're constant, they're constantly in your present, presence and they will uh, put their hands over their mouth or using their pointing finger, put it over their mouth has to tell you to shut up be quiet about your targeting you know as a threat to uh manipulate you into being silent or they will uh fight i've had this happen to me before uh my job and my manager was like i'm trying to save your job trying to gaslight me basically into be uh into being quiet but you know i videotaped took pictures record the things that they were doing all right and again when you refuse to be silent uh this is what they'll do to you uh, these are some of the things that they'll do to you okay but like i said i decided a long time ago that i was going to expose this and it was a conscious effort that i made knowing what they were going to do you see the red theme red 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 down there okay so yeah spotting out the themes and then the homeless theme the guy over here using always using the homeless theme as you guys can see All right now this is a this is a school that he goes so i want you guys to understand how they use these themes yeah now where the where where the police right where are the police where are the school security guards you don't see them today do you right you do not see them today because again like i said understanding their understand their agenda understand what it is that they're doing and how to use these themes these themes and how the police will keep away because they are an intricate part of uh of what it is that they are doing to you they are a part of the uh negative campaign against you the uh psychological threats right and so when they use these homeless themes again, stuff like that, you you won't see them. And again, this is this is a this is a a, a, um, a school, right? An elementary school. So you would think that they would be there because they're always there, except for today. And I wonder why. <laughs> okay, there you go. Now you know why. All right, I'll talk to you guys in the next video.